March is Kidney Month, and according to the National Kidney Foundation, more than 26 million Americans suffer from chronic kidney disease. Joe Ruchnowski joins us now with the story of a dialysis patient playing the waiting game. Yeah, his name is Richard Mish, and like many, Laura, he, he's waiting for a kidney transplant. He's on the list. Uh, he goes to dialysis three days a week, where he spends nearly four hours a day hooked up to a machine that essentially cleans his blood. Now, Richard's wife, Melissa, takes him out of her day, takes time out of her day, I should say, to pick him up and take him to dialysis treatments. Richard found out he had kidney disease when he was a child and has had to deal with the effects for nearly his entire life. And now at age 40, his disease has taken an even bigger toll on his quality of life. Had a kidney transplant when? Uh, 1995. It never worked, and I'm still currently on dialysis. I've been on quite a long time. I'm young, and I've been on 17 years. And I'm, I'm on the list again uh, to get a kidney. So it wears you out. Uh, you get, I'm, now that I'm getting older, I'm getting short of breath and all kinds of things. It's tough. Some days are harder than others. It depends on how he feels. And it gets depressing. Coming up April 18th, it's the Northwest Ohio Kidney Foundation's fundraiser. It's called Kilometers for Kidneys. It will take place at the Lucas County Arena. Registration is at noon, and all the proceeds stay right here in Northwest Ohio to help families like Richards. For more information on the walk, please go to our website, foxfilo.com, or you can contact the Kidney Foundation directly at kfnwo.org. Joe Rogelski, Fox Toledo News.